We don't do a lot of fishing videos at Run and Arrow, but this is definitely one you don't want to miss. This is Pro Staff Stephen Richter and his father and a couple friends as they go in Missouri for snagging for paddlefish. Uh, this happened just a few days ago. They went out with a guide and uh, check out the action they had. What's up, guys? Steve-O here from Run and Arrow. It's snagging day. We came down to Warsaw, put the boat in the water. This place is plumb packed today. Yeah, no, I see that. But you get a good, good, good forecast day during snagging season. Everybody and their brother is going to be down here. We couldn't get in no fish yesterday. So today, myself, John, my dad, and Chad, we hooked up with this guy named Jack. He is, is it Lake Ozark's Bow Fishing and Adventures? Yeah. Lake Ozark Bow Fishing and Adventure Service. He's gonna teach us how to run dipsy divers. He's gonna put us over fish. Him and his boy Justin getting everything ready to go. We just tested our depth out. A lot of trash on the water, but I'm excited. Y'all stay tuned. We'll see if we can't put some fish in the boat. Oh yeah, look at this dude's bike. He wants to run. You know, he's near the boat, don't he? It's like pulling in a barn door, ain't it? Yes, sir. Remember 182. 180. That shit ain't got wind, you gotta work against him. Yes, sir. You tighten your drag up just a little bit. Maybe. Right. Hey, I see the bubbles right Thank there. Thank you. Alright. Almost there. Oh, boy. There he is. Hey! Let me get him up here close. Step up that way and I'll gap him. Alright. That's a good one. That is a good one. To the keeper. They're all oh. good for keepers. Yes, sir. Look at that. Yeah. Go slow. Come on. Give you some. He barely hooked. Give you some slack. There you go. Raise your tip up. Raise your tip up more. Hey. Heck yeah! Look at there, boys! That's a good one there. That's a damn good one. Alright. Alright, fish number two. It was a lot better. Oops, sorry. Alright, Dad. Oh, he can stay in there. He ain't bothering me. Pop in the old chair does, here. Does, does he need to come this way? <laughs> You're a dandy. Here we go, Dad. He's got a car he's gonna pull up, ain't he? <laughs> Feels like he's pulling on a door, don't it, Dad? That's a big one. Here we go. Here we go. I believe it is. That might be bigger than my fish, Dad. Wouldn't be surprised. Hey, you coming in like that and they flow their old gills out and it just has more it's like a big parachute, like a dragon parachute. Yeah, oh he's barely hooked. Oh he's rolled all up in it, he ain't going nowhere. Open their mouth. Yeah. Easier to get them in the boat that way. Just a hair star. Well, probably ought to, but I think it's a little late. I know he'll keep. He's a keeper. I know he's about a 40 inch or jump. He's about a 40 pound fish. There you go, Daddy. Typically 40 inches or about 40 pounds. Cool. Start, bud. Oh, yeah, it's all right. Yeah. You back up here a minute. I'm the same way. There you go, Dad. Turn him sideways. There you go. Yeah, not really. 
Well, you hear the horse was like, you just, you know, you the travel. other boats were like, yeah, he's, John, you can take it or what? Yeah, yeah you can. Come on, baby. Do you? Now it's not the time to get tired, Chad. <laughs> Keep going, man. Keep going. Get that adrenaline running. Oh, baby. I didn't take it. I didn't take it. More drinks. Getting tired. They hit the surface sometimes. They go nuts. Yeah. <laughs> they don't want to give up the ghost, do they? I thought he was down. Move your boat. Shine, dude. You just gotta step right behind you, dude. You don't have to move. You're all right. <laughs> it looked like a pretty big fish, the glimpse I got. Well, I'm glad Chad got the one that wants to argue. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> That is a big one. There we go. Yeah, buddy. Eagle's nest and an eagle up there. Great. Good job. Good communication. Is it on there? Yeah. Heck yeah. Sometimes you jack around like that and lose a bitch. I need to go that way. Bounce the boat out a little bit. Huh? Yeah. What? I'm afraid you're going to check that up and build. All right, boys. Another fish. Another fish. No. That's going to be real close. Nah. Tape measure. I don't think that one's gonna be keeper size. Yeah, I don't think if it is. It's barely. Jack and easy. Yeah. Hey, Jack, are they all? Yeah. Back. All right. 31 and a half. They got to be 34. Do you want a picture with him? No, I'm good. There. We got some video of him. <laughs> He'll be all right. Pilot. Put that thing down at the bottom, trying to dig a hole. How teeny weeny it looks. We kind of found the magic number going that direction. Yeah. You got to find the magic number going this way. Right. Fish on. That was it. Fish on. Do that. That one hit a little harder. It might be a bigger fish.
not a streamer. <laughs> okay, let's get the lines crossed again and give them a challenge. <laughs> Heck yeah, boys! That's what I like hearing. Hey! That's a real good fish. Oh my. Yeah, if I don't get to touch the rod and feel it, I can't hardly tell what you're Right. Well, it didn't even feel like it was that big. Oh, he's diving now. He's coming with the current, probably. He's coming in with the current. Well, it's a turtle monster, but it's better than that last one. <laughs> <laughs> it's a keeper, at least. And there he was fighting against the current, too. It's a good fish. Heck yeah. He's a bleeder. Yes, sir. We got a bleeder. Pick him up and hold him for the camera. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Fish on! I'm already recording. I was starting to think I was going to change something up. <laughs> Jesus Don't let, don't let it slack. Give me a break. Uh -huh. Give me a break. He just worn out. Uh, it says 150. Oh, God. <laughs> All right. Yeah, he took a lot from me. I couldn't hold him. Well, he's so heavy that about every third spin, I'm actually losing a little bit. Watch your feet. Watch your feet, Steven. Not a keeper. Cramping up. Won't hold for too long yesterday. 
heavier than my first fish was. You're just yeah. weaker. You're just weaker. Oh, shut up. <laughs> That's a big fish. That's a monster. Got another fish on. You're so excited you want to do a little dance. Well, Steven had the record for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just feeling compared to the other one. I think so. <laughs> you ain't you ain't my way, you do what you gotta do. There we go. There we go. Got another thrasher. <laughs> I'm done with him. I guess he was bigger than I thought. Yeah. I thought it was not even going to be a keeper. He's kind of swimming toward the boat for a little bit. Yeah. Hey, go, Chad. Yeah. Only 280 more feet to go. Encounter messes with your head. Yeah, it does. Because I look down and I see 150, 100, and it's like, God damn. Well, and then I, when I was pulling that fish up, I got to zero, and then it went back to 999, and started counting down again. I'm like, what am I into here? All right, Dad. What? This guy works for trackers. Talk to him. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, oh, hooked in the good. bill. He did that on purpose, Dave. Looks like a keeper, guys. Looks pretty yeah. close. Might have to tape him. Boy, he's mad. Oh, yeah. He's mad. Yes, sir. This right here is a good day, boys. 
Got seven fish in the boat. Five minutes to spare. John's working on putting a two-man limit in the boat. This is awesome. Yeah, Chad, you said earlier, you're reeling in, you're looking down at that, that counter. Yeah. I never did that last time. <laughs> it was like, 200? No. 130? <laughs> I wish I wouldn't have looked. <laughs> That's right, same messes with your head once you start looking at it. Yep. Seems like that one's gonna be a fucking car. Fighter. Or something. Still pretty big? Yeah. Wow. Let's get you in the boat. Let's quit jacking around. No one in the in the paddle. Yeah, it is. Right behind his eyes. There you go, buddy. Good. Yeah. Well, All right, guys. We made it back to the dock. Gonna get ready to empty this boat off, get some pictures, and clean up some fish. I still can't believe we caught a four-man limit in four hours. That that was just awesome. I want to say a huge thank you to our guide, Mr. Jack. He put us on the fish this morning. It was all his doing. Y'all get a chance, you're down here and you want to go with some awesome people, get with Lake Ozark Boat Fishing and Adventure Service because they really put us on them. I'm Steve O. Y'all have a good day. We'll check you on the next one. Thank you.